SEO is the cheapest method to gain visitors to your website, but SEO is not the best strategy anymore in 2025. If you want to gain thousands of visitors to your website for free within three months like this, and this, you will need to add AEO to your marketing strategy. In the upcoming 50 minutes, I'm going to show you how to do this, which tools I use, and how to write AEO friendly content. But let's start with the meaning of SEO and AEO. SEO means search engine optimization. Once you optimize your content for search engines like Google, Yahoo, and Bing, people will find your website while searching on the World Wide Web. AEO means answer engine optimization. This new strategy is born due to the introduction of AI tools like ChatGPT and Google Gemini. These AI tools might replace search engines in the near future. But what's the difference between SEO and AEO? SEO is more focused on keywords. For example, you are selling online coaching for people that want to lose weight. With SEO, you will focus on keywords like lose weight, lose belly fat or healthy breakfast meals. On the other hand, AEO is more focused on questions. How can I lose weight? How many calories should I eat to lose weight? What is a good breakfast meal to lose weight? And so forth. Does that mean that SEO is dead? No, SEO is not dead. However, the approach and strategy behind it becomes different. And you know what the best part is? Nobody else does this yet because they simply don't know of the existence of AEO and how to apply this strategy in their business. So if you start with this strategy now, you are still an early adapter and can achieve some nice position in both search engines and AI tools. Makes sense so far, but feeling a bit overwhelmed already? No worries. I will guide you through the entire process step by step. In that way, by the end of this video, you're able to set up this entire strategy yourself and gain thousands of free visitors to your site only within three months. First, we need to know which focus keywords have a high search volume and a low competition level. And for this, I have set up an automated workflow with make.com and Airtable. I'm using the Data for SEO API to retrieve data about keywords. To receive a perfect outcome, I will need to add some keywords myself. You can do this by literally picking your brain or by starting a search in Google yourself and see what recommendations you get once typing a couple of keywords. Besides, I choose to only focus on low competition keywords. In that way, it is easier for me to gain a higher position on both search engines and AI tools. Since we're a new website, our domain authority will be low. For that reason, ranking on low competition keywords is easier and will have faster results. As you can see, I have also added JSON modules in this workflow. This has the purpose to split all keywords in different rows so that I can add them easily in an Airtable. Last, I will add the keywords search volume, competition level and search intent into Airtable. The search intent can be informational, navigational, commercial and transactional. If my purpose is to not only gain visitors, but also gain sales, I would start focusing on keywords that have a commercial or transactional search intent. With this, we have a list of 100 keywords and completed our keyword research. But before we can create content, there's one important thing you need to take into account. ChatGPT uses the Bing search engine as their knowledge base. Google Gemini uses Google search engine as their knowledge base. It's fair to say that you will need to focus on both search engines to have the best results, but that's not all. There are some important tricks to get an even better result. Tricks that might seem difficult, but are very easy to achieve if you follow these steps. The first is featured snippets, basically the FAQ of Google and Bing itself. Once your website is shown in the featured snippets, you can be certain that ChatGPT or Google Gemini will refer to you as a reliable source. Second, the search behavior in ChatGPT and Google Gemini is different compared to the regular search engines like Google and Bing. You might have already connected the dots. Due to the introduction of ChatGPT and Google Gemini, 
people are not searching for keywords, but asking questions instead. This also happens in the search engines itself. We simply got used to talking to a virtual human and we ask questions instead of writing a couple of keywords as if we want to be polite to the bot. And this has an enormous impact on both SEO and AEO. It means we should not only take into consideration our primary keywords, but more importantly, the frequently asked questions about our product, service, or niche. And luckily, we can repeat the exact same process we did for our keyword research. With just a couple adjustments in our make workflow, we can retrieve questions instead of keywords. As a filter, we now have added that the keyword should contain either the word how or what. In this way, we will only get keywords that are questions. Once that is applied, we will add the questions search volume, competition level and search intent in another Airtable again, so that we have a nice overview of 50 frequently asked questions. Based on this, we can start optimizing our website for keywords and questions, which will give you a higher chance to get a top 10 position in both search engines and AI tools. But having those keywords and questions all sorted out doesn't mean you have well-written content lying on the shelf waiting to get published. So, how to write million-dollar content that not only attracts visitors but also sells your products or service? There are a couple of ways to achieve this. First, creating content for your product or landing page. These pages are your sales pages. Once people land on the product or landing page, the only goal of that page is to convince them to order your product or service without getting distracted. Therefore, it is very important that your product and landing pages have a high ranking position. These pages will give you the most sales. Second, we need blog posts. These posts will give you more visitors than sales, but if they are well written, they will convince the visitors to click on an internal link within that blog post and get redirected to your product or landing page. The product or landing page focuses on the keywords. The blog post will focus on answering questions, but that will not be enough. The most important element of this strategy is internal linking. Let me show you a couple of examples. This landing page is focused on the keyword calorie calculator. It has an FAQ with common questions and links to the blog post with additional information. This blog post is focused on answering questions, how to calculate your calorie needs. It will promote the service and will link to the landing page. Besides, it will also link to the category page. This is what we call internal linking. We link to other pages on our website, which make the keyword or question even more relevant. And third, copywriting. A well-optimized product page, landing page, or blog post need to follow a certain structure. For example, the title should contain the keyword or question, the first paragraph should contain the keyword or question, images should be added to the page with the keyword as an alt text, the keyword or question should appear in one of the subheadings, and so forth. We have tested multiple prompts for the best outcome. Copywriting these days is easy with the use of ChatGPT as long as you know how to use it. Now, I can imagine that all of this can feel a bit overwhelming, even though you've probably realized that you will need to focus on an SEO and AEO strategy for your business, it's hard to decide where to start even with the tips I gave in this video. And because of this, I have decided to do something insane. Something I have never done before. But it feels like a perfect moment to enable every single entrepreneur, no matter the budget, to get this strategy going and gain thousands of visitors. Instead of you having troubles getting all the relevant information and setting up difficult workflows with JSON parsers, I will do it for you. I will give you 100 keywords, 50 questions, one prompt for writing an AEO blog post and one prompt for writing a product description or landing page. Honestly, I don't even know the worth of this. Marketing agencies will probably charge thousands of dollars for this. I will not do that. Instead, I will give this tailored SEO and AEO strategy away almost for free. For a one-time investment of 20 euros, I will give again 100 keywords, 50 questions, one prompt for blog posts and one prompt for product descriptions, all based on your input within 48 hours. In this way, you can be an early adapter and grow your business for only 20 euros. It's a no brainer. So click the link in the description below to get started right away. Now, if you don't have 20 euros to invest to get this up and running for you, 
you can always choose to download the make.com blueprint and ChatGPT prompts for copywriting via the link in the description below. In that way, you can try it out yourself. And let's be straight, if you're hesitant to invest just 20 euros, it might be worth reconsidering whether you're truly ready to start a business. Every venture requires some level of investment, whether it's time, effort, or money. If even a small financial commitment feels like a hurdle, building and growing a successful business may be even a greater challenge. Don't forget, either be the first or the last. Now is the time to be the first and stay the best. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below this video if you have any additional questions. Or maybe we'll talk personally soon about your SEO and AEO strategy. Did I already mention you can get access to your personal strategy for only 20 euros? That's right. So let's get started.